Hello everybody and welcome to Learning with Mrs Gray. This week we are learning about space and I found a book that's all about astronauts. Astronauts are people that go to space. Look, they're going to space in a... Oh, what's that? A rocket. Yeah, and they're going to visit all the different planets, lots, lots of planets in the sky. If you peep into the night sky, past the clouds and way up high, what can you see? What can you see in the sky? What are all these here? Oh, like you see at night time. Twinkling stars and a glowing moon. You're peeping right into space. The stars and the moon are part of space. There's lots of people down there. So these people are looking at a map, a special map that shows all the different planets and all the different stars. And this, these people here, they're looking through a telescope. That's a telescope. And a telescope makes things look really close. So when you look at the moon through the telescope, it looks really big. So you can have a better, a better view of it. People can fly into space to explore. They go up in a rocket. There's the rocket. Five. Four, three, two, one, blast off! And it flies through the clouds. There it is, look, it's, this is Earth, this is where we live, on Earth. And the rocket's flown up into space. And they might be going to visit the moon. I have to have a look. Away from our earth and into the night black space. Some people have been to the moon. They landed on it and walked around. They felt light and floaty. Now the moon, it doesn't have something called gravity. And gravity makes your feet stick to the floor. But in space... There isn't any gravity, so people bounce, boing, 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 and float around, like float into the into space. It was dusty and quiet on the moon. There were big holes called craters. These are the big holes here, look, craters. Oh, look, the astronaut, here he is, look, the astronaut. He's going boing, 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 bouncing on the moon. People are out in space right now on a space station. People inside, peep inside to see what they are doing. Oh, I wonder what they're doing. So this is a space station and that might be flying around now, but we can't see it because we're too far away. People who go into space are called astronauts. So let's peep inside. What are they doing? Floating around and eating. Look, they're eating. Eating oranges, I think. But look, their food is floating. He's floating and the food is floating. Oh dear. And what's happening in this part here? Working Working with a robot and with a computer. Oh, working with a robot and a computer. Because they use lots of robots and things like that on the, on the moon. An astronaut has to wear a space suit to go outside. There is, there is no air in space. So the suit carries air to breathe. Help this astronaut put on his... Helmet. Oh, his helmet. There it is. Can you put on your helmet? 
can you help the astronaut put on his oh look he's got special clothes i'll make them make them fold over so you can see put on his arms look he's got special special gloves there we go he's got special trousers there he is look he's all ready to go to the moon There he is. In space, everything floats. People float. The space station floats. Even the moon and earth float. That's, we live on earth. And the earth floats. It takes a while to get used to it. Ooh, it's flying all over. Look, this one's all upside down. This astronaut is fixing the space station. So something's got broken. Can you see? Something's broken. Uh-oh. One of the screws has come loose. It might have come out of here. Or there, look. Oh, dear. Gonna have to fix it. Can you see where he keeps his tools? Oh. Can you see where he keeps his tools? I wonder if it's here. Let's have a look. Oh, look, they're inside. There's his tools. He's got a screwdriver and a spanner. Got lots of things in there. Look. Oh, and he's holding. He's holding the screw now. Look. So I wonder if he will fix the space station with that screw there. Astronauts always work in twos. Always work with another person. Can you see the other person? I wonder where he is. I wonder if he's in here. Let's have a look. Ah, oh, there he is. Here I am. That's his friend. There's one, two astronauts. Two astronauts. Let's have a look. There are all kinds of things out in space. This is the sun. Here it is, look, the sun. It's a big fiery ball. What's that peeping out from behind it? Let's have a look what's behind the, behind the sun. There it is, there's the sun. Let's see what's behind the sun. It's planet Earth. That's where we are. That's where we live. It goes in circles around the sun. There are lots of other planets, but they're too far away to visit. So people sent a spaceship to send to take photographs. There are lots of planets. It went around the planet Jupiter. That's Jupiter there. It and passed the planet Saturn. This is Saturn and Saturn's got a big ring that goes all the way around the planet. And it's still going. It's still taking pictures in space. It's been going for a long, long time, flying through space, taking different pictures. Another spaceship dropped a robot on the planet Mars. It, it was wrapped up in bouncy balloons, so it didn't break. There it is, look. And there are all the bouncy balloons. The robot drove around exploring. It found red rocks and red sky, but nobody was living there. So it was empty, just like that that planet that um, little bear went to, where there was no no people living there, or oh, well, no animals, nothing, nothing there. It was just empty, just rocks. Beep 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 beep. There it is. Look, collected lots of samples, collecting rocks to take back to Earth. So that the scientists can have a look at them. We haven't found anyone living on the other planets yet, but space is so huge, there might be somebody out there. Can you see somebody peeping there? Look. Oh, I wonder who that might be. Oh, let's have a look. Hello. Oh, it might be some aliens. Hello, hello. 
the end. So that was a lovely story about space. I hope you learned lots of different things about astronauts. So astronauts have to wear a special helmet and it pumps oxygen into the helmet because there's no, we, in, in space, you can't go and breathe because there's no oxygen. It'll make you poorly. So they have to have a special helmet that, that pumps oxygen into the helmet. There's lots of different planets in space, but they haven't found anybody else. Nobody else lives there. They haven't. The scientists haven't seen anybody yet. But I wonder if there is anybody out there. We just don't know. Nobody knows. So tonight, when you're looking up at the stars, you have a little think about who you might see in space. Okay, have a lovely day. And I'll see you again. See see you again at school very soon. Okay. Bye.